Hey. I, uh, spin through the, the stuff we have, the garbage, offline. Sold all that. Well, sold a lot of it. We have so much garbage. We have, I'm keeping so much more than we'll ever need, I assume. I hope. Um, added a few more things I'm interested in here, just to make the list ridiculous again. And we have started in a few new productions. Ah, this thing gonna take that long, and then we can move on all this. We are gonna start recycling some necroplane parts, just because I realized it said random production, it wasn't just one for one necroplane parts to scrap metal. We don't know what we're getting. Oh, we also need to open that box. So we could do that straight away. How many does it take to open a box? Well, five do it instantly. One hours is the quickest um, a thing can happen. Nurse outfit. Nice. Perfect. Great. Love it. If you're calling is healing, not maiming. This one's for you. The outfit comes with a large medical bag containing 20 uses of each painkiller, surgery kit, stim, uh, and stim. Has, it counts as 12 weight, does the surgery bag, I guess? So you start with 12 less weight. Interesting. Pain resist one. So, Nan was asking, is there a, can you be a healer and not a, this probably means one hand is always full with medical bag, and then you only, you only get one hand to shoot, same as the shields. Interesting. We need people thinking about chain gun. Um, I don't know what you know, but these are really quick, so let's just do a few of them. Yeah, we're gonna spy on ninjas. You think that'd be difficult? I want to try making one of those, but I don't have enough exquisite lingerie because I sold all of it. Before we started. This is tragic. Next one we get, I'll try and remember to keep. Smooth cat. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Young females kidnapped by various brutes for their beauty. As in, physical health and the right amount of tender meat. Either for slavery, consumption, or organ harvesting. We get a lot of good press for freeing them. And we can either ransom them back to their home communities for some nice coin. However, at a discount. Or introduce them to our big and growing family here. Really? We can recruit them? And we know about ghost gates now. Rumours say the country is haunted. And if you take a wrong turn, you could find a vampire. Or worse. Legend has it, just after conquering the Earth, the Star Gods had to curb excess population levels of that time. So they resettled billions of people from the whole, Eur the whole Eurasia onto the isolated subcontinent only to destroy them with a host of nasty plagues. Some killing outright, some causing slow agony, some putting people in a death-like state, or even doing more bizarre things. Could be why we've got zombies to deal with. While the notion that there could ever be a billion people living on the planet, let alone multiple billions, seems a bit of a stretch. Ghost Gates is definitely spooky, with its endless old boneyards and ruins, scattered throughout lush jungles, and its silent, big-eyed inhabitants living in dozens of disparate countries and towns, not to mention that the five aristocratic families of old, who have the right to elect the local patriarch, could well be the vampires of legend, judging by their looks and decadence. Weird. Hmm. We can either slave them or rescue them. We cannot... I'll work them. We cannot... Recruit. But... Rescue seems nice. <gasps> Rescue's very good. We're doing some rescuing. Give me those points. Also, Necropirate. These guys apparently... <laughs> Is this an album cover or something? <laughs> These guys apparently had the same idea as us. To become pirates. Desiring to strengthen their bodies, they gave in to the practice of consuming zombie flesh. While they succeeded in gaining great resilience, it ultimately caused degeneration. Now they're desperate for every morsel of helium tainted flesh, zombie or otherwise. At least that much we can divine from their barely articulate ramblings. Might be a lesson to us, because really, 
They're useless for anything else. Dang. Don't like those guys. Cats! Ooh, weird. Witch heaven. An autonomy within the autonomy. Legends speak of this city as a cradle of science and progress. But nowadays there's hardly anything left to be called science. And absolutely no trace of the city's history of rebellious mages. Around 2186, the Star Gods determined that the local magical community had forgotten their place, and, with the blessings of the Star Governor, obliterated the city. Only its name survived. Since then, no witches have been seen in the city once made them it, that once made them its namesake. Although, it's whispered that somewhere in the suburbs there's an underground magic market, hidden so deeply that it'd be useless to try and find it on our own. We do have a magic wand. We did get a magic wand from one of those missions. <gasps> we have a supply crate. We got energy weapon parts and scrap metal. That's not great. Okay. Uh, also, I just remembered like two episodes ago. I left a mission over here that we were going to do when we came back. I was here somewhere. Somewhere in this this half of the globe. Uh, and then completely forgot about it. And we never did it. And that one timed out. It's fine. I didn't want to do it anyway. It was uh, one of those go shoot up a bound missions. I hate those. Just just pointing out that I've realized. Did I Right, no, I've rescued the I remember. Do we have enough points to do stuff? I want this. Don't really want the other things. Because the bad. We already have lots of Jerry thread, we steal a lot of it. Harpoon carbine! Not doing great on tokens. Just not giving us any. We want them. Hmm. Small craft, very small um, aggressive range. Very slow. I think we let him pass. I don't think it's worth shooting down fires. I think that's just a fire. I think we could kill it. I think it's one of the bandit fires. Because if you're finding out, that means you're engaged in combat and you're kind of stuck there. Are these the uh, Loch Ness we recruited? Yeah, they are. New friends. They're rat people. We love them. Um, let's get them some armor. If we can. Um, do I have any armor for him? Maybe I don't. Maybe I don't have any armor that can wear. Hang on, hang on. Yeah, we got peasant armor. We don't seem to have uh, Loch Nair armor. Long coat, new distar straps. They have very low strength, but their actual combat stats aren't that bad. They have low strength because they are tiny creatures. But they're not nearly as bad with a gun as peasants. Giant cockroach examination. Beautiful. These large mutated insects have proven to be indestructible as a species, and only got better over the last few centuries. Very hard to kill, unless with fire or poison gas. Omnivores, they attack with mandibles coated with saliva that dissolves most forms of matter. Gross. They are very resistant to charm. Kind of resistant to piercing. Good armor. Almost as good as we have. Cutting's okay. Cutting's a good... Cutting tends to do a lot of damage. I think cutting's a good a good response. I mean, shooting them's fine as well. It's fine. Just use slightly bigger guns than you might expect for fighting a big bug. They don't like... <laughs> smoke. Or is that poison? What's choking? We are getting through this... Re uh, research. Dang. I do want to read those government papers. Tell me, tell me all of it. Tell me about these carbines I've been using the whole game. I want to know. Brigand. Gravball League. What game is this? It looks beautiful. I want to play this on my channel. 
Is this just the, t the teams? Confederation, Red Bulls, Iron Tribe, Meaty Kings, uh, the Black Match, White Hawks, the Nod Federation, Blue Knights, the Fuso Flaming Kitsunes. Did I say that one right? Because it's the Japan word. Dark Dominion, the Jaguars. Hidden Expanse, Stout Spears. The... I can't read this. There's too much garbage in the background. It's fine. It's not that interesting anyway. Thanks for telling me, though. I want to know about Grav Ball. Anything anyone has to say about Grav Ball? Just tell me how the games are going recently. Troublemaker. These teenagers join bandits to escape the bleakness of their villages, get some thrills, and hang out with cool guys. They carry out support roles and do not present much threat in combat. They're quite brave due to their dumbness, though. Evil grass! This usually docile grass grows in many parts of the world. It doesn't normally pose a threat, but when disturbed by grazing animals, or landing of a ship, for that matter, it tries to snare any mobile life forms with its strong, flexible strands. It doesn't pose a real threat to anyone unless you doze off for many hours in it and let yourself be digested. In battle conditions, the evil grass slows down movement. I suggest using explosives. Take that, grass. What did I just read? I'm confused. <gasps> we can save them. <laughs> I kind of want to... Look, we're going to save one and we'll research the other. Right? That's fine. Enemies found in environments hazardous to us usually suffer no ill effects themselves. Really cannot feel comfortable anywhere outside the zones. What'd I get? What'd I get? 5mm rounds. And necroplane parts. From the necroplane parts. Recursive necroplane parts. Where's this in the list? I want to extract the necroplane parts into more necroplane parts. What the heck? <laughs> what? <laughs> it had more of the same thing inside it. It was a matryoshka doll of necroplane parts. Nice. Matryoshka doll. That's the one, right? Rust is coming back online. I wanted to do a thing, but I forgot what. Oh yeah, we're gonna put um, the lady back on. Troublemaker, get back in there. Tell me your secrets. Can we spy on these dang ninjas already? Been doing a lot of research, this, this one. That's the guy flying back again. Not interested. <sighs> interested. them again. The Academy. Looking for us. Probably are searching for a hideout. Well, guess what? You found it. Don't think they have guns? Ooh. Maximanship is not a strong point. We are very low on ammo. That's fine. We're going to get the 40mm gun soon, right? We're researching it. We already have one of these. I think we have two of these. Not counting the one we're researching. We've got a few. We just, we just need to think about it really hard. And then we're going to use it. And it's going to be fine. What's the weakest team we can send out? I do not respect these people. I do not fear them. Um... I'm going to train up my uh, worst soldiers on them. This is probably fine. Right? It's hard to tell now who's trained decently and who's not. But it looks fine to me. Some, some middling uh, units going out. This is a training mission. 
This is a milk run. Don't worry about it. Crash site 10. We shut down 10 crafts. How did we do it? Remember when we shut down zero crafts? It doesn't seem that long ago. Probably wasn't that long, many episodes ago. We're moving up in the world. This is more of a shooting armor, but I don't respect them, like I said. Let's go show them that. I'm gonna throw a bunch of acid at them. They're gonna hit. I'm gonna wear my hat. I'm not gonna wear my hat. Take a shotgun. We do have some things we need shooting. You also take a shotgun. This looks fine. We're gonna do it real good. One gooba wandering around in a field. Also, the craft is here. How ham do we want to go right now? How ham is it reasonable to go right now? A little worried. About moving out the way we are doing, but... I'm confident in the ladies. They're good at this game. Nope. Where do you stand? Here. He's fine. Give him a turn. Whoops. Oh, there was one inside the building I'm right next to. Whoops. Guess you should guess I should be watching for that, huh? That could have been bad. Also I stunned him too much even though I used the stun rod. What am I meant to do? They just die. How do I stun these people? They're terrible. Um, okay, you're not a threat. Neither of you are a threat. Neither of you have guns that can kill me. You both have stun weapons. Good luck stunning someone in power armor. Worried that I think there's another drone on these, right? The one last time. Worried about other drone. Ooh, who's that? They also don't have a killing weapon. Yeah, you're not even. Not even really hitting, are you? Terrible dart guns. Let's go hog wild. Well, I didn't realize I was running into this, to be honest, and I wish I had. Do we see the other drone? No. Hope it's not inside. I'm gonna go boop. I'm just gonna get out there and start smacking people with a big bit of wood. And if they die horribly. This isn't gonna stun anyone, is it? It's not a stun weapon when you give it to someone this strong, is it? It's fine. It's probably meaning they're having a horrible time and they're gonna start panicking. Which is what we want. We love that. We love to see it. Yeah, the, the stunning aspect has not really panned out. It's fine. Uh, 
Um, shouldn't have come in here, really, should I? Okay. Go get him. Where did they all go? You're too far away, so I'm gonna shoot you. Never mind, maybe I'm not. You're very close, so I'm gonna bop you. Yeah! That's how we do it. Good effect on Dark. You can go away. I did see a laser coming in from over this way. Were you? It was you. Also, I know there's this person. Let's drop that on the floor, because we're doing a bit too much murder. Maybe we can l murder them less if we just use our bare hands. See? Now they're only dying and not already dead. That's basically the best we've got for non-lethal. Uh, unless we use a stun rod, which even then has not had perfect results. Cut it out. I'm not gonna cut it out. I'm gonna keep doing it. Okay, they all seem to be panicking. That's excellent. Do love to see it. Um... Time I just move out on the map, I think, and uh... Well, we need to find the people who haven't panicked. We know there must be at least one of them out there. Are we sure there's not a second drone? Just get over there. No, we can't get in that part of the craft. It's, it's, there's no no ground there. It doesn't exist. It's fake. Ooh. Okay. Not sure how badly we got wounded right at the end there. Five nurses? We'll take as many as we can fit. We have so many ship engines, we're just gonna sell these ones. Actually, we had five. What if we need more than five? Are we likely to need more than five? We did good. Also, research. Can we slave researchers? We need to research for me now. Tell me all the secrets. We could accommodate all of those? Can we slave all of those? <laughs> what if... We lean heavy into this slavery thing that we're doing? What if that? Ooh, volleyball! Today, Brain has faced off against Runts in a volleyball game underneath one of our hangars. Everyone was covered in sludge. Now that's the game where everyone wins. Most of all, the spectators. Plus three pawn and glamour. Excellent. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Kev. Okay, we didn't get any necroplane parts out of our necroplane parts that time. That's a shame. I was hoping we could just keep going forever. Look how all the slaves we're getting. It's fine, they like it. This rapid fire weapon cannot be mounted on fast craft, but the upside is slightly better accuracy. Ground? Gross. Hmm. I haven't seen anything that uses that class. That's a shame. Can we unrust this blade and make it a good blade? Run out of things to do. Hmm. Leave that for now. 
Maybe if we learned how to build large vaults, we'd start to learn about this whole constructing things thing. Long range flame. Difficult in operation, but allows you to throw out some flames up to 20 tiles. That is too far. That's a lot. That's a lot of range on that flame. The Black Citadel. The capital of the autonomy. Which doesn't care about the other settlements within the country, so long as they pay the proper taxes and fees. And in the event that the other settlements decide to teach the haughty citadel a lesson, the sea is well fortified against external threats. In theory, they'd be capable of standing against even the star gods for about three hours. Black Citadel acquired its name after one such punitive action, in which almost the entire city was raised and the walls of the ancient castle in its centre were blackened with Hilarium soot. After the armistice, it was decided that the walls would not be washed and would remain a memorial to the victims of the war. I like the ones that are just about players. It's the weird and cool. It's a bug eye. He has perfect night vision. That's kind of scary. And we already know they have magic powers. That's not. We can't do anything about that. Um. While we're thinking, what? I, I mean, I guess I'd need a ground unit to... Wow, it goes zero miles an hour. Uh, two light slash DV. Don't know what that means. One missile. One light slash DV. Yeah, we don't have anything that fits ground weapons. Not true, possibly. Yeah, um, the convoy can. So it let us have a convoy that can fight back. Thinking. How capable would a convoy with a minigun on it be at fighting? See, we've been using one of these. It shoots real fast. We maybe should have just used the single one, to be honest, because it would uh, be a little bit more ammo efficient. Very, very bad damage. Very, very fast firing. Actually, decent accuracy. Same range as the other little guns. It's not bad, and I have two of them. I think I could mount two of them on something and I have 900 rounds of ammunition it's just getting it to where the enemy is you know realizing that um, the single 25 millimeter cannon is actually a little bit more ammo efficient we're gonna go with that because we are kind of strapped for ammo right now. We're never going to catch that one. We're not too worried about that. That also looks too fast. Are you looking for me? Um. Could always send out the air car. Doesn't have guns. That's a new thing. And it's fast. Weird. Um. I don't think it likes when you look at it. Perceiving. Hash thighs! How you doing, hash thighs? You're alright. Really use better armor here. You definitely cannot wear that. You would have zero stamina. Also, are we um, doing training here? Get hash thighs in there. I think some of the people got injured or possibly even murdered. Or I uh, did a transformation on them which injured them. It's fine. Micah Brassball? 
thought I said Mica Basketball. So I think me looking at that caused this wave of badness to happen. Which, if I had a ground craft, I could maybe try and intercept one or two of them. Even though it'd be slow, I could have just launched it and let one path over my base. Path directly over the top of me. Mm. If it's a gunship, we can predict where it's gonna go. Do I have a hanger? Might be a job for Nam Isle. I mean, we don't use this airspeeder, right? That's not true. We use it all the time. We use it when we want to do a mission somewhere and we're worried we might have to run away fast. Oh, we need to get somewhere really quickly. I think my current hangars are full to capacity, but I think if we build another one at Nam Isle, we can outfit that with um, guns. I'm building a general star here. We'll need... Proper barracks. Because this is going to be... Um, outpost and barrows are like 20 people max? That's not too bad if I'm not building anything here or out. These have a barrack and an outpost, and that's 35. I feel like I could. Put in some kind of workshop here, and sell x -Grog and... Maybe it'd be better than spending... Making this many plantations. We don't have a workshop, we have an extractor and it's crap. We can't even make a still, right? We just have a still because we started with it. That's why we don't build more stills and start making booze out of everywhere because we cannot do that. Makes sense. I think we've reached, we've reached the end of this episode. We've got thoughts about guns that go on the ground instead of in the sky. Maybe next time this this line of, of thinking will come to fruition. Probably not, because it's, it's a while before that, that hangar gets built. But, I hope you'll be back anywhere. Enjoy hanging out. Hopefully I'll see you then.